Are we rolling? Okay. Welcome back to Greasy Corner Garage NC. Here we are in Davidson, North Carolina. It is about 8.45 on November the 25th, Saturday morning. We are at Americana Live. And here we are. We're not quite going live right this second, but that's what they're calling it, Americana Live. So I just uh, really appreciate all y'all plugging in today. Um, stay tuned in, man. I've got some, there's some cars here. Y'all know that. This is probably the best one of the year, actually. Uh, definitely for the end of the year. So stick to the end. I've got some special treats for you. And I really appreciate y'all. Thank y'all so much. So I'm gonna quit talking and I'm gonna start walking. Let's get it. So here we are. There is three parking lots here today. So this is the first parking lot. That's where me and dad are parked at. Um, it's got the vintage drag cars in it. Um, part two is uh, up here on the hill. It's the next one to come to. And it's got the celebrity parking. That's Where all the real high-end Ferraris are, and uh, um, uh, there's some other vintage race cars up there, and a couple. There's some really nice stuff, some GT3s, some GT what, uh, three four, RS, you know, some really crazy stuff. But then there's a Part Three. Part Three is going to be the back parking lot, and then also the roundabout. And uh, there's some pretty cool cars. So don't miss any of those videos. There's going to be three parts of them of the Americana. Um, they call it Americana Live. So uh, please check out all them. Pretty good time and weather just to walk down there and catch that lineup of cars. That's pretty cool. So yeah, 1970 inline six cylinder Maverick. He <laughs> <laughs> ain't sure about that. That's a big dog. It's a good looking dog, guy. Thank you. Appreciate it. Here you go. 
So I walked up to record that uh, dog, and uh, the guy gave me a card. Check that out. His name was Fonzie. He's from Paris, Maine. He's a breed. He's a three-quarter Mastiff, quarter St. Bernard, date of birth, the intake, 60 pounds a month. That's crazy, but that's pretty cool. He's got his dog, and he's got a card to go along with it to tell you about the, the dog. That's pretty neat. Now the cars are pretty tight today, so I I don't know if I need to be walking in between every single one. Um, I think I'll walk around certain ones maybe. But yeah, that's a uh, that's a Cobra Jet. That's pretty sweet. Here we got another Maverick. And this is the one from last weekend. Look at there. And these are some of our buddies from the Ford Club here. A clean F-150. Here's the Wicked Fairlane. Now, y'all see many of reels of this car. It sounds really, really good. Now, see, we're parked right here. Now, check out this guy. He drove all the way from Wilmington, North Carolina. Shout out to Ramona, Kaya, Deanne. Left at 4.30 this morning. It's a 64? 64. 64. Yeah, he, uh, he's working out good. He just, he's a fucking So, yeah, the surfboard ain't fake. He, that, he really rides that thing. Yeah, you believe that shit. <laughs> she's a fat motherfucking belly. You think I'm riding that thing? Don't be cussing on the channel. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Now see, uh, we got dad parked over here with uh, all these uh, nostalgic drag cars. So check, that's pretty cool. Now I've been debating on uh, painting my headers white, kind of going this old school nostalgia thing. Uh, you know, not painting them, but ceramic coating them. Y'all leave in the comments, what do you think? Should I cer coat them burnt bronze, white, black, or silver? That's a cool rig right there. Look at the size of the fuel line on chains on the front too. Yeah. Yeah. Now this thing when he cranked it up and moved it earlier, you probably checked out the reel of it. Um, it smelled really, really good. I love some race gas. tight back in here. You don't want nobody walking around it, obviously. I'll let them run some gear all over the United States. Do you run it more? Yeah. Yeah, I've run it. Okay. 
I didn't see any dogs. I've seen a few already this morning. For all of you doggy lovers out there, you're gonna get your get your fix here in a little bit. Look at the intake on the thing. Huh? Yep. Thirty Model A Tudor Sedan. looks good this is the RTR they build these right across the street from us where the shops at Shout out the June bug. I don't know if y'all picked up on that, but that's a Volkswagen. <laughs> Look at the door panels. Wow, there's a lot of detail going on in there. We got the the swing in the back. Yeah, somebody's pretty good with a bead roller. That's for sure. That's that's sweet there. It's pretty odd. Yeah. Well, it's full swing. The 76 Ford Grand Torino, Starsky and Hutch. It's pretty neat. One thing about these cars, they... It's got the good one in it, though. I think this is when they started putting the, uh, the you know, the real, the real uh, restricted motors. They didn't make any power. We wanted to come to this show last year, but didn't make it. Didn't think the car was quite ready for it. Because, you know, last year we just debuted it at Foxtoberfest. 
So just with a good bit of a ride, you know, all that. Shout out to Derek and his father, Tim. What do you think about that Ecoline there? That's a 66. Sixty six GMC. It's for sale, thirty six thousand dollars. Yeah, I just you know the thing about these shows that the cars are parked so tight, I just don't like it. I can't get around them and then they're liable to ding doors and all that fun stuff. So you really need two spots for every car. That's just I kinda that's a thing. But as many cars that are here you'd never get them all in the parking lot. I mean, look at this thing, this is really cool here. Oh, you spilled some motor oil. <laughs> this truck is sweet. It's beautiful. Look at that big old shifter. Look at this bed. I mean, look at the fabrication in that bed. That is sweet. Like it's flat black. I wonder if it's powder coated or not. It probably is. It, the finish looks very good though, so I don't know. That might be paint. Might be hot rod black. And here's the future, old Fiona. She's looking all clean. I took a razor blade and scraped all the glass and scraped off 30 years of gunk. As you know, we're giving out the Bibles. We got the Fox Paws. We're giving away the, uh, the uh, touch cards from Quest. And I got some more stickers out here. And that beautiful 347 up under, look at that thing. Boy, I'll tell you what. Oh yeah, I got me a new sticker. Shout out to Automotive Specialist, Keith and Jeff Dorton. They are the masters of engine building. I changed the oil in that thing yesterday and it's just the oil looks beautiful in it. <laughs> it's crazy. You know, usually when you break them in, they'll have a little bit of, uh, you know, metallic, but no, not on his motors. Pretty cool Bel Air. I'm pretty sure it's a 59. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it is. Shout out to Jimmy Cox. <laughs> Y'all must be from Robertown. Nope. Nope. Kannapolis. Kannapolis? Okay, yeah, we are too. Concord. Yeah. Concord. No, our friend, his wife is down in the fire lot. Oh, is she? Yeah. Cool. She's a long walk down here. I think we'll be down later. <laughs> yeah. So she's in the next lot? She's a, no, she's all, she's all way at the end. In the back lot. So how many lots are there today? Uh, Do y'all know? Well, there's two little two ones here, and then you're going to walk down the roadway to the back lot. So three big lots. And then so, there's cars all the way down the roadway on both sides. Wow. Yeah. So y'all hear that. Don't be checking out. You know, go get you a nice cigar. Get you a nice cup of coffee. And just enjoy this. Check this. You know, enjoy this with us. This All right. car won last year. Did it really? Yep. Wow. Won the Ignite Trophy. Oh man. Well, that's that's Pretty great. With that, there were some hundred cars. Yeah. Really? Yeah. How many do you think? Do you think it's the same numbers today? Oh, there's more. Yeah, it looks like. I was wondering if the pl if the show in Daytona higher. was going to pull some people out. Nah, it's always the same weekend. Oh, okay. It's always right. the same weekend. But well, that's cool. Probably. So yeah. This is the 11th year race had this. So we'll probably break this video up in a couple different parts. So make sure you check out part two. Well, thank y'all so much. Thank you. Y'all have a fun day. I'm just a couple cars over in that old uh, Fairmont. Enjoy. Fairmont? <laughs> yeah. Ford Fairmont. My dad's got the Mercury's death over the black one. Okay. Yeah. Cool. Now look, we've been to a lot of shows this summer and uh, we ain't seen nothing like this. <laughs> that is neat.
That's amazing. That's pretty wild. That's what's cool about this show. You see a lot of different things. Pantera. Oh, that's, yeah, super. Yeah, we got to walk around this Pantera. It's a 72. Yeah. That's got a, yeah, that's, that's big. Yeah, I think that was a maybe a Cleveland in there. That looked bigger than a. What do you think? That looked bigger than a 302. Oh, okay. Or that's what 427. I don't know. Don't get me to lie to you. Sixty-one. She looks so cozy in there. <laughs> All right, that's, that's that's a good thing. Nineteen forty Coupe Deluxe. Yeah, I was kind of really hoping that they weren't going to play a lot of music today. So I don't have to put any music over this. We'll see. This is the best trunk in the show. In the show. If you're going back there, yeah, I, yeah, it's I'll new see. every show. Yeah. Uh -uh. Oh, really? It's really new? new? Okay, I've got to say I've seen it before. I got four sets. You ain't seen that He's got some junk in the trunk. Come on. He's got a pretty good collection going on. This car, yeah, it's just pristine. All the paperwork with it. Just, uh, gosh, I hate to think how much this is worth. Beautiful car, beautiful specimen. Did you see all of them? I did, I did. A lot of new stuff. Yeah, we got you at the last car. We're at the uh, church of Mount Pleasant. Okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I got, yeah. I got four sets of stuff. Wow. No shows the same. No shows the same. That's cool. That's cool. Got the little Deuce Coop album at the beach. It's okay. back there. Yeah. I uh, got the Eagles one that's back there. <laughs> I got the Sharpshooter Polaroid. Yeah. It's back. Made yeah. It came out in 72. That's cool. That's cool. And that was my grandfather's. I've never seen any. Really? And it looks refurbished. But it's not all beat up. Yeah. Stamped in and everything. Wow. That's cool. I That's appreciate beautiful. you. I love looking on your stuff. Man, thank you. Thank you so much. It's got an Arizona tag on the back of this thing. For sale. Was this car? I don't know. It might have been. This is this was uh at Gateway. Yeah. Oh obviously. It's being sold at Gateway. Who to do? Custom Camper 20. Oh man, look at that. That's beautiful. Beautiful 55 Bel Air. Wow. And they're still rolling in. W30.
So I just think that I'm probably going to break this video up in the parking lot. I think that'd be smart. Oh man, that's beautiful. Thank you. You're at Gateway as well, right? Yes, sir. Yeah. Yeah, you filmed me at Gateway. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah, that's a beautiful car. Me. Beautiful car. Thank you. This is our buddies here from Kanapolis. They from the uh, community church, Mount Pleasant. Yeah. Yep. He's uh, he works with my wife at Billstein. Okay. Cool. He's one of the sales guys at uh, at Billstein. Okay. Okay. In fact, I my wife. My wife works for Bill Stein. I, I work with Penske Racing. Okay. And, uh, <laughs> so I got Bill Stein coilovers all the way around on this right, car. So yeah. Right. So you're the guy, huh? You give us a deal on some uh, some drag shocks. Not me. He might be able to work <laughs> he something. Might be out, able to work yeah. Not yeah. me. Yeah, we've talked to him before about it. Yeah. Yeah, we need some. Uh, you know, we got some QA ones on the front of that Zephyr. Yep. And they've lasted. They've done really good. Oh, We're yeah. a lot of them blowing out, and you know that they had a bad reputation, but we got a good yeah. pair. Yep. But yeah, we got to upgrade. You know, oh, that, yeah. that makes the car hit the tooth. Yep. Something totally different at the drag strip when you've yep. got $4,000 oh, yeah. worth of shocks. Yeah. At least. You know, when them I guys first... are spending 2500 a piece yeah. on them. Oh, yeah. Which is crazy. When I first got this car, it had the Aldens on the front. Okay. And it had the fake the fake coilovers on the rear. Ah. So it was the uh, competition engineering. So yeah. what they did is they take the bottom part is, is all threaded and looks like a regular coilover, right? Mm -hmm. But then they put inside of that, they put a Monroe Matic shock inside oh, of wow. it. Oh, so wow. He's, he's telling so, secrets now. Yeah. The, so the, the, <laughs> the, the, it, the, the coilover was basically for looks, and then you could adjust the ride height is about all you could do, but it didn't. Okay. Yeah. It was junk. So. Yeah. Yeah. So got the Bill Steins in there and had a good time with it. Right, right. <laughs> so now it handles a lot better, huh? Oh, yeah. yeah. Cool. Definitely yeah. better. Well, hey, thank you for Pleasure sharing that with you. us. Yeah, Take appreciate care. it. This, this makes all the difference in the world, handling wise. Man, you would never, it, there's no telling what you're going to learn. You just got to sometimes be quiet and listen. Here we go, I found some more doggies for you. Hey, doggies. So I'm not wrong. How you doing? <laughs> I'm sorry, it looks like a treat. <laughs> <laughs> Four twenty seven Cobra. Look at that. That's sweet. Now y'all pay close attention to this uh the color here, this this golf color scheme. My car was a little bit lighter blue. I think the orange would look good. What about an orange stripe at the bottom? Hmm. See, we're all waiting patiently so we can get some pictures and videos. <laughs> now go ahead. Yeah, it's a beautiful car. What you doing in there? <laughs> Playing on the phone. Yeah, it's cool. Yeah, we had about, about a week and a half. Didn't do anything. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's, uh, it does good. Yeah. Seventy-two C10. Well, he's got for sale in it too. A lot of cars here for sale. Guess it's that time of the year, huh? Clean motor. <laughs> here we go. We got the Pontiac line up here. Holding. SS.
55 F100. That's a big money build. Alright, so that concludes the first parking lot. I want you to go on, hit the like, hit the share button, uh, comment on me, see if you, uh, in, you know, let me know what you think about that, the Gulf color scheme, putting that orange line on the Fairmont. Um, but click down on the next video and we'll go to part two. We're going to check out another parking lot.